Okay, we'll start with the Mustard C67S, size 8. This is an egg, egg caddis hook, a very strong hook. I'll attach our tying thread. This is the damsel stalking bug. Very good when you're fishing selective big fish that won't seem to go for anything. Very animated. And we get rid of that. We need a, a bunch of very fine uh, tapered marabou. Like so for the tail. Not too much because you'll find the more you use the less animated it will be when it's fished. Okay, I'll we'll just tie this in. That's looking good. Well, except for that one fibre, and I'll sort that out soon. So we just go up the hook shank with this. Tie that down. Don't crowd the hook eye because you're going to have to finish there later. You need a bit of space for that. So we'll go back down here. Don't like that one. That's looking absolutely perfect. Very nice indeed. So, what we need now is a short length of lead wire. This is a weighted pattern, so and we just put that there and we want to make a few tight turns. Get rid of that. Just wind this up. Like so. And we can go back up here. Just secure it with a few turns of tying thread. This is going to fish upside down, so and it, it really does uh, jig. It's a real attractor. Okay, now what we want is a bunch of peacock hurl. This I take from the eye of the peacock. It's normally something that you don't use very often. So it's good to use up the material. Tie this in at the back. Now you've got to make sure that these are longer than the tail otherwise you'll have problems pulling the wing case over afterwards uh, and not excluding the tail. There we are. Good. Now we want to split our tying thread. Put two CDC hackles in this magic clip. But what I want to do is I want to trim off these back ones, like so, at an angle. Because I want these long ones at the front so they flow around the short ones at the back. So when we put this in the magic clip we want the long hairs at the front, at the bottom of the clip, in the loop. So they are the last ones we wind on get the longer legs near the head of the fly. We put those in, get these out of the way, we don't want to spin that tail in it, and then we can spin this up. Good, then we wind this on, fold in. Goes back as we go. Give that a bit of a brush just to pull out. There we are. Then we take our shell back, hurl shell back, or wing case, whatever you want to call it, 
and we pull this over tie it down we can now remove those close to the head and give it a whip finish Finish, we start at the front, work our way back, and again. Excellent. Remove the tying thread. Just give it a brush. And that's it. That's the finished damsel stalking bug. Excellent pattern. Thanks for watching.